Um, I'm just going to play a couple songs for you. And uh, yeah, as I said, it does feel a bit post coital. Please don't smoke or vape or any of that. <laughs> So essentially, I'm, I'm going to do a song um, that I, I, I rewrote a Bob Dylan song, which sounds like absolute sacrilege. Um, but I've been listening to a lot of Bob Dylan recently because I'm listening to every single record from the 1960s. Yes, mm. really. And I'm uh, midway through 1966, and we've got through uh, Dylan going electric, etc. Uh, and he did Highway 61 Revisited, which is fantastic. And there's a song on there you might know called um, Ballad of a Thin Man. And I remembered it from my childhood, and my, it really struck me. I really enjoyed it. And I had a little look at the lyrics and was trying to work out what, what he was saying, because he's just so fantastic. And uh, the long and short of it, I mean, there's a, a recurring line in it over and over again, as he does, is uh, there's something happening... And you don't know what it is, do you, Mr. Jones? And the, uh, it was basically, it's 1960s, you've got the Vietnam War going on and hippies and free love and all of that. And it was just kind of a commentary on the older generation just not understanding what was going on. And it occurred to me that that's kind of what's happening now, but against the trans community. Like this older generation is very sort of blinkered perspective are people who just don't fucking know what's going on and they need to, to get with it. So I, I thought it would be really nice to, to try to rewrite it. Uh, and then I just sort of sat on the idea. And then uh, I do a bit of pub work. Uh, and one night, I was locking in a pub. And I was there one side of the bar, people smoking and drinking. And I had literally four people staring at me, telling me that as the mother of a trans son, that I had wronged him and that, oh, I should not be perpetuating a fantasy. And I was like, oh, I've got to do this thing. So I don't know if it's worthwhile, whatever. It's, it's for me more than anything. The fact that Alice has asked me to come and play it is really lovely. So th thank you very much. I'm gonna... Yay! I also must admit, I'm really fucking hungover because I'm American, in case you can tell. And it was Thanksgiving on Thursday. So uh, here we go. That was my caveat. <laughs> Make you laugh. <laughs> Way to go, me. So 